The Rafale F-5's design has been officially submitted by the Ministry of Defense and is known to the French Parliament. Also, the operational and purported combat skills of the F-5 variant are presented in the military report. French Dassault Aviation is putting a lot of effort into developing the newest Rafale F-5 combat jet. The first deliveries are scheduled for 2030, when it is anticipated to go into operation. According to sources and publications in the French media, the peak of output could happen between 2032 and 2035. Possibility several features have been verified. For instance, the F-5 will emphasize electronic warfare. France and the rest of the globe have been made aware by recent events in Ukraine that electronic countermeasures will be crucial in future conflicts. But according to reports, it will work both ways. That is, it will launch electronic attacks in addition to engaging opposing weapon platforms. The F-5's capability to engage by disabling and destroying opponent air defenses is another breakthrough. Suppression of enemy air defenses, or SEED, is what is meant by this. By creating new anti-radar anti-radiadian missiles, this will be accomplished. Regarding the anti-radiadian missiles development stage, there is still no clear information available. The French Air Force FAF appears to have miscalculated the effect of this sort of missile. A long time ago, Armat was a standard weapon on French fighter jets, particularly the Mirage F-1 and Mirage 2000 series. The missile's warhead is made up of a hang rope and a proximity fuse, and it has all 120 km range. Based on the Anglo-French Martel missile, Armat was created. The integration of Armat missiles into the DAS Ultra Fail was never decided upon by France. In comparison to the F-3 and F-4 Rafales that the French Air Force currently uses, the F-5 will undergo additional upgrades to increase capabilities. According to reports, the F-5 will work with UCAV attack drones. Most likely, the new French Rafale F-5 will come with updated avionics and mission computers. The explanation is that the F-5 is rumored to have new sensors, weapons, and communication and cooperation opportunities distribution and transfer of data and information. The mission computer needed more RAM and increased computing power for this. Then the local Air Force will attempt to keep its Rafale Air Fleet at least until 2070, according to plans from the French Ministry of Defense. This implies that the European Future Combat Aircraft System FCAS and the F-5 will be able to communicate. Yet, some claim that the F-5 was created as a backup plan in case FCAS didn't work. It makes reasonable that Paris would seek a backup strategy in the event that FCAS were to fail. Although there have been some comparable indications, Paris and Berlin appear to be focusing on improving their relationship, and in March, they jointly decided to begin the crucial phase one with Spain. France has no plans to give up on the F-5 Rafale, which will have some similarities to the upcoming generation of European aircraft, notwithstanding phase one. Even though the Rafale F-5 won't be completed until 2023, Dassault Aviation is enjoying a genuine resurgence on the global market. Just a year ago, our production line was on the verge of being shut down. Now, at least one more must be opened. The record-breaking Rafale aircraft orders from last year and this year are the cause. A total of 164 Rafales, including 125 for export and 39 for France, are under order. The Rafales, which are now deployed in France, are anticipated to be delivered to Greece, Indonesia, and the United Arab Emirates.